Good evening, and thanks for joining us for News 3 at 10 on this Easter Sunday. I'm Leah Lynchide. First tonight, a young woman has died and two of her friends injured after police say a drunk driver hit them in downtown Madison this weekend. It happened around 7.30 last night at the intersection of South Park Street and West Washington Avenue. Police say a car jumped the curb and hit the three pedestrians. Two were treated on scene, the third taken to the hospital where she died from her injuries. Our Carrie Larson is live on South Park Street with what witnesses are saying tonight, Carrie. Leah, it is truly tragic what happened here last night. Madison resident Adam Seeger created this memorial to remember the victim who he says is a 24-year-old UW student from China. People have been adding to this all day in honor of her life. It was around 7.30 Saturday night. Adam Seeger heard a crash outside his apartment. I dialed 911 and then came down to see if I could help with the CPR, but there were a couple nurses here who are on their way home from work, so that was lucky. Despite their quick assistance, a 24-year-old student died after being struck by a drunk driver. It's senseless. Could have been avoided. Two other students who were also hit told Adam they were on their way to study when the car came out of nowhere. She would have been walking by the sidewalk and these signs were broken clean off at the base and the car came to a stop off of this telephone pole. Adam says the woman flew several feet in the air before landing on the concrete. Once outside, he focused on making her friends as comfortable as possible. Again, these were Chinese-speaking students, and it's doubly scary when you're not in your own city and culture. After learning more about the victim, Adam created this memorial to honor her life. White is a Chinese color of mourning, so I thought I'd come down and at least get something started. And use it to send a message. I want to make sure that people understand that driving drunk actually has a real cost. This woman came here to study at the university to make her life and everybody else's life better. And now all we can do is put this memorial. I sure hope the driver's last drink was worth it. Now, MPD says the driver was taken to the hospital with serious injuries, but is now in police custody. The victim's name is not being released pending family notification. And Leah, of course, we will provide any updates we receive on channel3000.com and right here on News 3. All right, our Carrie Larson reporting live tonight. Thanks, Carrie.